for either one of you guys. Um, the first question is actually pretty much what Jiggy just said. Uh, fifth largest crowd in league history, largest attendance uh, for the league since 1999. Split crowd almost resembled almost like a tournament game in college. Just wondering what you guys thought of the atmosphere tonight. I mean, I don't know about split. Um, I think this game was sold out a long time ago. Um, we actually did sell it out before last year in the playoffs, um, in the regular season, and then of course in the playoffs. So, I mean, yeah, it was great. We had we had a ton of fans. Um, but um, they also there's a lot of Iowa fans that love Kate Martin and Megan Gustin too. So, um, that that has to get said a little bit. But yeah, I mean, I think we have tremendous fans, and it was an amazing environment, and I'm just grateful that we got the win. Chelsea or Asia, this is for you one of you. Kevin with Fuel Sports Network. You guys erupted today on both the offensive and decent defensive side. Kelsey, you were it was like you were pushing for that 40 tonight. And uh Asia, you of course just did Asia Wilson things. What was it like for you guys combining for a good 62 points? And what was that defense giving you to just make it easy for you guys to find the bucket? Um, honestly, I think coming off of like our Washington game, it wasn't Asian KP. <laughs> um, and that's okay. We're going to have nice like that. So I think coming into this game, we just wanted to get back into the pool of us, wanted to get a better feel for the game. Um, and it was just, it, and some looks were tough, some looks were smooth. So we kind of took what the defense was giving us throughout the, the flow of the game and our te teammates kept finding us. So I think we just kind of used this game to really kind of get back to us, get back in the flow of things. Uh, we had a rest, a, a day of rest kind of just to kind of get back into us. And I think that's what you saw. Um, it was just us, honestly. It's crazy that you'd be averaging, you know, she really averages 28 a game. Like, that's just like a normal day at the office. That's absurd. Like, you realize that, right? And everyone's like doubling, tripling and game planning. And it really doesn't matter. Like, I think that we need to put it in perspective, like, just another night at the office, like we take it for granted, but we're watching one of the greatest players of all time in front of our eyes. And it's like, dang, like, let's, I think that's like 28 is like, oh yes, Asia had 28. Like, that's crazy. You know what I mean? Like, I, I just, I'm serious. So I just wish that like, you know, moving forward that we're like, it's a unanimous vote this year. You feel me? Oh yeah, she's MVP for sure. <laughs> well, no, I understand, but there's a difference between MVP and unanimous. Just saying. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Kelsey. <laughs> Question for either one of you. Um, just Kia Stokes grabbing 12 rebounds. She took and, my uh, rebound. Zach Young. You know what your thoughts on, the, on those? Oh, Kia, here? share the freaking love, dog. Damn. But no, I mean, that's Kia. Like, this is why Kia is who she is, and this is why she is, like, why we love her so much. Um, she does the dirty stuff that doesn't necessarily show up on a stat sheet. But when you're talking about 12 rebounds, like, that, that's incredible when it comes to just the the – the work hard factor, the want to. Um, and that's why she'll forever be the anchor of this defense. I don't care how many awards they would give us for defense or whatever. Kia is the main reason why we're allowed to do us and play us. She steals rebounds. She's a thief. But I love it. If we can get 12 rebounds out of Kia every single night, I I'm happy with it. Speaking of the defensive side of the ball, Asia, obviously you held them to uh, both in the second and the fourth quarter to 13 points and under yeah. for their entire team. I uh, just talked about some of the key aspects defensively that you're able to do. It wasn't just on Caitlin Clark uh, as far as her shooting night, but it was also Samuelson and Smith weren't able to get much going either. What defensively did you guys bring to the table tonight that was a big factor? Just being on a string, uh, communicating, understanding, and trusting one another that we're going to be where we need to be um, and continuing just to just, just to show some of the simple things. When you're a player, we know, like, if people just show it, kind of shakes you up a little bit. So just being in the, the, the way – Sometimes is the the key, and so I think today we were very like we made them uncomfortable, um, and nobody likes to be uncomfortable, especially on the court. So I think that's what really kind of helped us then push on the offensive side because we we do a pretty decent job of playing out of our defense.